Hi guys, Kevlar here. This is another video on how to install Sifu mods. There's so many mods out there, but there's two that have just recently come out that I'm quite excited about, and one in particular is the one that I've really been waiting for. I've done a video before, you see here, you might have seen that one before, of how to install the Sifu mods, and we had the John Wick and the Mike Lowry one there. And today we're looking at Bruce Lee, which is the one I'm really excited about, and Harley Quinn. Okay, I'm going to say at the start of this video, the Bruce Lee mod is free, it's on the Nexus website, which is perfect. But the Harley Quinn one is on a paid website, the one that I pay to get some mods from. Now the paid website, Patreon, as I shared in my previous video about the John Wick mod, it's got loads of mods on there, so actually I think I've got my money's worth. Now I'm not promoting this website, I've got nothing to do with them, it's just that's the only place I've found it safely. And the only reason I'm paying to get these ones is because when I was trying to get the John Wick one before, I followed a different YouTube video where they said you can get it for free, I followed the link and I got a Trojan malware virus on my PC. That's why I'm only sharing a safe ways to get these mods. If you want to go and find them elsewhere or try and get them free, then that's obviously at your own risk. So we'll start off with the free one, the Bruce Lee one. So the Bruce Lee one is on the Nexus mods website, which is here. So I'm already in the Sifu area, but what you want to do is you want to search at the top here under games search for Sifu, brings you to this page, click on Sifu there, you scroll down and go to explore all mods and there's tons of mods on here so you know I'm not going to do a video on every one but these are the two that I'm most excited about so you can scroll down I think Bruce Lee one was on page two at the moment yeah so it's been out for quite a few days actually I've only just realized it's there so players Bruce Lee so we'll click on that one scroll down here Go to files we're going to do manual download okay click slow download i mean i should have mentioned you need to sign into the, this website it's free but sign up um and then if you don't pay you just get the slow download which isn't slow at all so it's not a problem okay there we go and i've got my file opening up here this has opened up in the, the raw converter now go watch my other video, I'll link it at the end of this video if you want to work out how to get this software. It's like an unzipping software, but it unzips these raw file types. So once you've got these, you can copy these. This comes with a special move list for Bruce Lee as well. So there's four files instead of two. So the bottom two is the pack for the, the skin, and then the top two will be for moves. Copy those, then you need to go and find where your game is saved. So for me, I've set up a games folder. So this is my folder here for Sifu. Um, but if you haven't changed anything in your Epic Games 4, it should be in your C drive program files under games, and then you'll find a Sifu folder. Then within your Sifu folder, you go into Sifu again, content, and then packs. Okay, now these Nexus mods can be pasted directly into this packs folder because they don't overwrite the packs that are already in there. But when we come to look at the mods from the Patreon website, that's why we have the mods folder so they can go in there So because they come exactly the same format as these two here and you don't want to overwrite them. Okay, so I've got them in there now. So I'm going to go into Sifu, see if it worked. Excellent, here we go. Bruce Lee, get him in some light so we can see him better. So one thing to note that you need to make sure you're aware of because uh, I've got a few questions about this in the last video about installing these mods is these mods are for the character once you're in the main game so if you're starting a brand new game you still have to do the first scene with the guy with the long hair where you have to go through the intro and then fight the old Sifu man that will still be the old character then once you select your character you need to make sure you select the right gender so if you, if you pick the girl character and then you're going to try and use this uh, Bruce Lee mod who's a male it won't work you need to make sure you select male and then you'll end up being Bruce Lee when you actually get into this main game okay cool so that's Bruce Lee so let's go and have a look at the other mod right so first of all I'm going to remove those two out of my folder before I put in the new mod okay so the Harley Quinn one is in a website called Patreon and you'll see it's come up straight away because that's the latest one he's done so Patreon then there's a guy called the Beyonders he's the one that shares or creates all of these mods on here 
just scroll down you can see he's done quite a few and this is where I got the John Wick one from and the Mike Lowry one from there's John Wick he's got a version 4 update because he keeps updating things for bugs and this is the one like I said I've had to pay for so £4 a month so for me I've signed up I'm probably only gonna carry on being a member for this month one month while I get loads of mods for Sifu then I can cancel my subscription so it's really only cost me £4 for a load of mods which yeah it's annoying to have to pay for them but you know it scared me after getting that virus I don't trust some other people on YouTube sharing dodgy links so for this one you got the zip here there we go same process it's downloaded a zip file and for me again with this software it's already unzipped the raw package for me two files here copy those Back to your Sifu game folder. Now, as I said before, you'll see these have exactly the same file names as these packs that are already in there. If you paste them here and overwrite those packs, your game won't open. And that's why you need this mods folder. So that squiggly symbol and then mods. Paste them in there. Right now, Harley Quinn's a female. So I'm going to need to go and play the game from the start to be able to select the female character because I was currently the male character for this mod to work. So I'm going to go and play the game and I'll see you once I've got to the end and select my female character. Actually I've got a female game here but I'm aged 58 so I don't know if it's going to work because I think sometimes you need to make sure you're a young character but let's see. Ah it did work. There you go so I'm actually halfway through a game here and she looks really good actually this is a really cool mod so this looks a lot better than that Bruce Lee one so you know although this isn't one of the paid ones it's almost like you, you get what you pay for yeah this one's awesome alright let's go and beat this dude up oh I should have had the weapon with me oh he's easy though This has got to be the best mod I've seen so far, to be honest, in this game. I think she looks so cool. Ah, even the entrance scene works with her. Right, so anyway, yeah, here we are. We're back in our little base bit area. Let's put her in the light like we did with Bruce Lee. There we are. Hope you found that useful. Hope you enjoy these mods. Like I say, this one's really cool. It's a shame this is one of the paid ones, but I think she looks really good. But yeah, that's it. Please do give us a like and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next video. Cheers.